Tightening up your calving distribution has been studied for years and it's been shown as one of the biggest economic benefits of, of anything you can do in the cow-calf industry. It's basically shrinking your breeding window down. Usually it's 63 days for cows and 42 days for heifers. That's the most standard recommendation in the industry. The basic premise of the calculator is really looking at that short-term economic gain of having calves born earlier in the calving season. We try to sell as consistent of a calf crop as possible direct to the feedlot, so we're trying to create uniformity and you can't have a spread in, in gap with your calving intervals. Even this year being a little drier, we tightened it up a little bit. We kind of went down to 50 days on the cow herd. Um, and a lot of times when we're preg checking now, the fertility's improved that anything that's a little later, we can cull right off the bat if we're in excess of numbers. The nice thing about the calculator is it shows you something beyond just a pregnancy rate. You may have a 90% pregnancy rate, which seems, oh, that's pretty good, that's not too bad. But if you don't have 60% of those cows calving in the first 21 days, you could be leaving a lot of cash behind. It could be 39 pounds for every 21 days earlier they're born. That could be well over 70 pounds, 80 pounds of weaning weight difference between those two calves. We know that heifers born in the first 21 days are more likely to stay in the herd longer. They're more likely to get pregnant. Uh, in fact, a recent research paper would show that they give one more calf in their, in their reproductive lifetime than a, than a heifer that was born later in the calving season, which is a significant economic benefit. Ideally, we're condensing our calving to uh, 60 days or less, uh, and that helps us just utilize our genetics better, make a better evaluation of the genetics in the resulting calf crop. Then from a management standpoint, uh, Shortened calving season helps us uh, better time vaccinations to our, our herd. So using some of these tools, producers could uh, stand to benefit greatly. No matter what size your operation is, how many uh, animals you have, or, or what sector you're in. We've always traditionally been kind of pen to paper, cowboy math, and now if there's a tool we can just plug our calving interval dates in there, it's, it's that much easier.